that we're going to need to talk about um, going around town. So we're going to start off with the word for library. Is the kanji to shokang. To shokang. And the first kanji to, that means a graphic, a representation using a picture. The next one you should recognize means to write. And the third one means a public building. So a public building where you can write and there are things represented in graphic form. To shokang. Next, we know this word department store. It's from the English departo. Of course, it's from the longer word departamento store. But now they just say departo. Next, gakko. You should know that very well. Toile. Toile. Don't make the mistake of adding the T on the end. It's not toiletto. It's toile. Here's a new one, another word for toilet. And this is often found in public toilets on the sign is O te, it's honourable hand, alai, to wash. O te alai, a hand washing place. Of course, we know that's a euphemism, it's really a toilet. And toilet, of course, itself is a euphemism because toilet just means making yourself clean and attractive. Um, I suppose the real word is WC, isn't it? A water closet. But here in Japan, o te alai, a toilet. Next, puru. No need to explain that. Puru. Up here, restaurant. Do not add the T on the end. Restoran. 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 Museum. That's another public building. So we've got the public building kanji. And we've got hakubutsu kan. Hakubutsu kan. Hakubutsu kan. That's a museum. An art gallery is also a public building. So we've got kan on the end. But it's bijutsu, as in the school subject art. Bijutsu kan. Bijutsukang, an art gallery. This one you should know, here's the kanji, and when it means home it's pronounced uchi, and when you use it to mean a house, the same, very same kanji is pronounced ie. Now there's no actual way to tell which is the pronunciation other than the context of the story. So if you choose to read it uchi, as in your home, you can, and if you choose to read it ie, as in a house, that's fine, but here we're going to be using uchi. Finally, the interrogative, and you should know where Doko, 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 and a map. There's that same kanji we met a moment ago to mean a graphic representation. And here the first kanji, chi, means a place. So a place and then a graphic representation of that place is, of course, a map. Chizu, chizu. Not to be confused with cheese, meaning cheese, which would obviously be in katakana, not hiragana or kanji. Chizu, chizu.